Friday, it is time for our community corner, and we are shining a light on the incredible work being done by the Salvation Army Boise Corps. Joining us is Development Director Lindsay Klein. Lindsay, so great to have you, and I love the sweater. Thanks. You're in the holiday season spirit here. Christmas is upon the Salvation Army already. We're we're busy planning away. I bet you are, because you got a lot to do. For those who are not familiar, though, give us a quick little background here of the Salvation Army Boise Corps. What do you guys do? Uh, the Salvation Army in Boise, we serve the Ada County community um, with their basic human needs. So we have a food pantry that feeds about 19,000 individuals in need each year. We have our booth program for young parents in partnership with Cardinal Academy and New Horizon where we um, come together and educate teen parents looking to finish high school. We have a Pathway of Hope uh, program for case management for families looking to break the cycle of generational poverty. And then we have our food pantry and seasonal assistances and Christmas. The yes. Salvation Army is known for Christmas. <laughs> yes, you are. Okay, what are some of the biggest challenges though that your organization faces, especially in this current environment? The, the challenges that we're really facing right now is just an increase in need in our community. And so just folks out there are just really struggling and, um, you know, we're doing the best that we can to meet the needs. And so um, I guess income would be our biggest challenge and just face fighting, you know, inflation. You, you know, everybody feels it at the grocery store. And so just helping us be able to continue to serve the folks that need us the most. Okay, so how can those watching those support the Salvation Army? Uh, well, Christmas is upon us. Yes. And, um, <laughs> On November 5th, we have our Red Kettle kickoff, and so we would love for folks to join us for a luncheon. Um, it's 12 to 1, and it's our, one of our biggest fundraisers of the year. And then also helping us fill volunteer slots with um, ringing the bells. And so uh, if you go to registertoring.com and type in your zip code, you can find a location to ring near you. Okay, so anyone can sign up then to ring a bell. Absolutely, anybody. It's a great holiday tradition with your family to start, yes. or if you have a company looking to, you know, serve the community, taking a shift to, to ring bells really helps us, and you get to help your community as well. And when it comes to ringing bells, what areas do you serve in our community? We serve the entire Treasure Valley. Okay. All right, so we're talking Boise, Meridian, Nampa, Caldwell. Yep. All throughout the communities, you can pick a spot and yes. then decide to ring a bell. Yes, and all the dollars stay local in that community. So if you're ringing Caldwell, it goes to support programs in Caldwell. If you're in Boise, it supports Boise as well as Nampa. Okay, and then what are some other ways too? Can people donate? Can they also volunteer? Not only during the holiday season, right? I know you got your sweater on. Yes. We're pushing for the holidays but we can also be a part of this year round, right? Correct. Uh, you can also go to boise.salvationarmy.org and visit our website on how to volunteer in this community and you can find different volunteer opportunities um, through the holidays for those holiday traditions of giving back or all year round. So um, if you've got a project, we, if you've got a group to volunteer, yeah. we've got a project for Wonderful. you. Wonderful. So. And then back to ringing the bell, right? In the, the kettle project, it's, I, like you mentioned, it's usually a tradition for most families to participate, and it's also a tradition for some families to donate, right? Correct. I've seen families come with their kids and on the way out of the grocery store or into it, uh, you know, dropping whatever they have in their pocket in there or being very intentional about it and having the kids bring some of their stuff and donate at the same time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's wonderful to have people look forward to that opportunity, I think, throughout the holiday season. So if you've never had the chance to ring a bell, which I strongly suggest you do it, uh, now is the year to, to pick up that opportunity and uh, see what it's all about. So again, where do people go so they can sign up? Uh, to ring bells, you can go to registertoring.com and type in your zip code and uh, opportunities will pop up for you, hopefully near you. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Greatly appreciate it. And as Thank mentioned, you. there's so much that the Salvation Army does here in our community. So if you want to be a part of it year round, or if you just want to learn more about how you can give back and, uh, and the future opportunities throughout the rest of the year, make sure you go to their website. Thank you again. And everyone stay